What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Moto WordPress Teams and in today's video we're gonna learn how to use an arrow key keyboard navigation to our posts or WordPress pages, okay? So what is this? Imagine that you are into a certain page or post of your blog using your WordPress website and if you hit the left or right arrow of your keyboard, you're gonna be navigating between posts okay so if you click you go to the next post or go to the previous post according to the arrow that you click into your keyboard and we're learning we're gonna learn how to enable this how to activate this on our site in a simple free fast and effective method okay so before I can start please take a moment to be part of the visual moto family by clicking into the subscribe button liking this video sharing this content with a friend of yours do a comment in the case that you like this video or have some question it helps us a lot you have no idea we bring daily videos about wordpress seo plugins optimizations and many more topics in order to use internet on yours and your site's favor okay so let's get this started First of all, move to our WordPress dashboard, okay? Once on dashboard, review the left sidebar of menus and hover your mouse over plugins. Once you're doing this, you're gonna be able to see a new button called Add New. Click on it. From the upper right corner of your screen, go into the search plugins, you're gonna type WP Code, okay? So, what is WP Code? WP Code is one of my favorite plugins, okay? In order to in order to apply code snippets into your WordPress website. You can apply this code into the theme functions PHP, however, it's a quite risky once you may broke your site, practically. So using this plugin, you can apply custom code on your site without problem. And the plugin is free, okay? So it's good to go. Go to, click on install, activate. This is gonna redirect you to this list, that is the plugins list where you're gonna be able to see all of the correctly installed plugins on your site. But if you take a moment to review once again the left sidebar of menus of our WordPress dashboard, you're gonna be able to see a new button next to settings, call it WP, call it code snippets, okay? That is the WP code light version, okay? And from here, if you go to this part, you can go to the add snippet or click into this button right here. All snippets, add new. From here, you can choose from one of the previously added snippets, but I'm gonna use another one. So I'm gonna click in add your custom code, new snippet, click into this button. Right here, first of all, I'm gonna need to type um, title. So in this case, it's gonna be arrow nav keyboard, okay? So, so, we have the title, now the code type, we must select universal snippet, okay? Normally it came on HTML snippet, please change this before writing your code. Now I'm gonna place the code. If you do not want to, I, I recommend that you stop the video, pause the video right here, copy this to your site and go to your site, okay? But if you do not like to copy, type part by part, even if it has only 10 lines, you can contact me into the comments so I can email you or give you the codes once YouTube does not let me place the code into the video description. So sorry for that, okay? Hope YouTube lets us to apply codes into the video description soon. But normally, pause the video, copy this, okay? And we are good to go. After this, another and the last part, the auto insert, select this part right here, and into the location, we're gonna click on it and change from site-wide footer, okay? Normally it came on site-wide header, but change to site-wide footer. After this, change this switcher that yours gonna be inactive, change for active, okay? And update the code or publish the code. After the code published, all we have to do is go, for example, to your blog, right here, for example, in my blog, I have the hello world, the natural ways, the solar panels, and the doubts about sustainability energy, all of those posts. And to navigate between the posts, now I'm just hitting the right side, the right arrow of my keyboard and the posts gonna change, okay? So, next and previous buttons. 
As you can see, we can move between posts in a very simple and easy way, and this helps your site engagement, okay? So persons can easier navigate between your site. This is a keyboard shortcode, okay? So you must have a keyboard to work on it, but it works also on pages, it works on posts, it works in all of these parts of your site. So really, really simple and works great. And it is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question. Feel free to install our free WordPress plugin, the Borderless, that gives you widgets, elements, templates and tools, okay? And even pre-built websites that you can import with a single click, like this one that I'm using into my example, okay? This website can be imported completely for free, okay? All you have to do is go to your WordPress dashboard, pay plugins, add new, Search for our borderless WordPress plugin, install and activate it. And if you are using our Enzo free WordPress team, this team right here that you can install on WordPress, dashboard, appearance, themes, add new, search for Enzo and activate, you're gonna be access to this full library of pre-built websites that you can import with a single click. And here is the one that I'm using right here, okay? Simple, easy, and fast. Moreover, if you want to access to our full library of pre-built websites, premium support, premium design assets, elements, tools, and many more templates, go to visualmoto.com, purchase the Visual Moto Pass, and go premium. And it is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I see you tomorrow. All the best.